we're here in North America. Down here in the south on the Florida Peninsula. In a special habitat known as the Cypress Swamp. It's us, the Crad Brothers. I'm Martin. I'm Chris. And this water we're paddling through is full of fish life. Like pike and bass. And that makes it a perfect habitat for one of the greatest fisher creatures on the planet. Fisher creatures? Yo, bro, is that even a word? Yeah, there's fishermen, why not fisher creature? Oh, why not? And this fisher creature is so good at catching fish, he makes fishermen jealous. But when you're looking for this fisher creature, don't look down into the water. You look up into the sky or in the top of a cypress tree for one of the most amazing fish-catching raptors in the world, the osprey! The osprey is one of nature's most expert fisher creatures. She finds an area with lots of fish, and then she flies high in the sky where no fish can see her. Whatever fish we can see, the osprey can see so many more. He's got that advantage of being up high, scanning the whole body of water here. When she spots one she likes, she dives. Whoa! She plucks the fish right out of the water and then flies off with it. That is a fisher creature. Osprey are such good fisher creatures. An osprey can catch a fish eight out of every 10 times she tries. I mean, that's an incredible record. She hardly ever misses. But what's the secret to the osprey's fishing power? Special vision? Special talents? Is there a secret to the osprey's technique? Imagine if we knew. Imagine if we had the fishing powers of the osprey. What if? On adventure with the coolest creatures, from the oceans to the trees, the brothers crack out going places you never get to see. Hanging with their creature friends, get ready, it's the hour. We're gonna save some animals today with creature power. Okay, Jimmy, power the Tortuga down and remove the key while I inspect the flipper leg deployment. On it! Power is off, and I am removing the keys. You're all clear! <gasps> I'm gonna be careful with the Tortuga key this time. Without this, none of the Tortuga technology can work! The turtles on my lounger look so cool, it's like they're floating alongside me. <laughs> nice! Ah, but my fish are better. So realistic. It's like they're swimming along right under me. Are you kidding? It's like I'm floating on the backs of turtles. Yeah, but we've done that before. Have we ever floated on the backs of fish? <laughs> Who did that? That raptor! But I've been laughing so I couldn't see what kind of raptor it was. <laughs> well, one thing we know, he liked my fish floaty better. <laughs> uh, bros? Incoming! Of course! Oh, an osprey! <gasps> the Great Fish Hunter! Oh, that is definitely our creature adventure today. To find out why the osprey is the greatest fish-catching raptor in the world! Yes, what is the secret to his creature power? Increíble! The osprey is one creature power suit that must be made. But it all happened so fast. I didn't get any specific info at all. Well, we've got to follow him then. I've got my mobile invention kit fully charged and ready to go. As soon as we can get a close look at an osprey, and you guys can get me some observations... Don't drop the key. Don't drop the key. Then I can make the osprey dip. <laughs> oh, no! I lost the key to the 
our tortuga again! Uh, <laughs> Jimmy? Huh? <laughs> the tortuga key! Thank you, Koki! Thank you, thank you, thank you! You were lucky this time, but remember what happened last time you dropped the tortuga key into the water? <gasps> we spent the whole day looking for the key, and we were really lucky we found it. I know what we can do. We can put the key on a floating keychain so it never sinks, and we can use this floating rubber fish. That should work. Ah, thanks, Kogi. Now I can relax a little. Oh, what a boring day! I wonder what those wild rats are up to. Computer, search wild rats! Sorry, my greatness. No result for wild rats. Are you sure you don't mean wild crats? Well, of course I mean wild crats! Oh! Don't you know me by now? I need better technology. Okay, we've got to get airborne and keep up with the Osprey to discover his creature powers. Falcon Flyer? Uh, too glidey. We need something with power. The rocket. Way too fast. Doesn't turn tight. The buzz bikes! Oh, these should do the trick. Yeah! Woohoo! Hey, buddy. Nice day for flying, huh? Oh! Hey! Oh. Can you show us how to catch fish like that? I don't think he likes these big bus bikes. Let's back off and give him some space. Yeah, he definitely doesn't like big flying machines being around him. Well, then the only way to keep up with a hunting osprey and discover the secrets behind his creature powers is to miniaturize. Back to the Tortuga. Race ya. Game on! <laughs> Uh-oh, we're almost out of buzz power. We can't forget to plug these bikes into the Tortuga when we get back. Oh, hey, bros. When did you get here? Just now. But we need to get back out there again and fly with that amazing raptor. Yeah, we're going to miniaturize the buzz bikes as soon as we get them charged up. Uh, bros? Hey, there's no power in the miniaturizer either. Uh, bros? We'll just plug it in and charge it up. <laughs> uh, bros? The Tortuga has no power to power the miniaturizer. What? Why? Because we had to power down while Koki was working on the Tortuga. We can turn the power back on as soon as she's done. I've got the key right here. <laughs> oh, no! I lost the key to the Tortuga! Uh, I must have dropped it! I hope not into the water again. Oh, don't tell me it uh, sunk. Oh, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? There it is! Where? That looks like a fish. <laughs> That's the key! We put it on a rubber fish for flotation, just in case. A fish with a key on his tail! Ha <laughs> ha, cool! It didn't sink! Whew. Yeah, but it's floating away! Oh no! You've got to get it! Please, please, please! Don't worry, Jimmy. We're on it! <laughs> uh, we never charged the buzz bikes, did we? Whoa! No! <laughs> Uh-oh! There's so much glare coming off the water! I can't see the key. Where is it? I floated out to sea. It could be going anywhere. Hey, if an osprey can find a fish in the water and through the glare, then osprey powers can find our key. Especially because the key is on a rubber fish? We've got to figure out some way to get up there and fly with the osprey. But we can't miniaturize any of our flying vehicles because the miniaturizer is out of power. If you can find a small flying creature and activate creature powers, you might come out small size and flying. That's a great idea, Viva. Brilliant. One of your best ever. Thanks.
I love any reason to activate creature powers. I'm okay with that, as long as it gets the key back. Okay, let's split up and look for any small flyer. And if you find one first, call me on the creature pod. Chris, I found a dragonfly. I found a hummingbird. Activate dragonfly power. So long, bro. We're small size. It worked. Let's fly. Chris, Mark, I've had no luck. Searching with a bow doesn't help. The glare off the water is still too strong, and I can't find the Tortuga key. It's out here somewhere and floating away. We're on it. Oh, yeah. Wild cracks located. Oh, goody. Where are they? What is it? Is it good for me? Searching with a boat doesn't help. The glare off the water is still too strong, and I can't find the Tortuga key. It's out here somewhere and floating away. Tortuga key? That is good for me. Floating away? That's even better. If I find that key first, I will control all the Wild Kratts technology. Ooh, I must have that key. Take me there. Alright, I'm ready. Find out how an osprey finds and catches fish. And then, with osprey powers, we'll be able to find the tortuga key. Oh, we're on it. So if we find an area with a lot of fish, we have the best chance of finding an osprey. Whoa! 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 Careful what you wish for, bro! Whoa! Whoa! We found a lot of fish, all right. Oh, but we're in the danger zone. Let's get higher to where the ospreys soar. Whoa! Osprey! All right, it worked. He likes mini us. When we're small size, he doesn't mind us flying with him at all. Osprey sidekicks calling floating turtle. Come in, Floating Turtle. Aviva here. Floating Turtle, we're with the Osprey. Are you ready to receive observations? Bring it, bros. Okay, it looks like the Osprey starts his fish hunt by soaring. He can hold this flying position effortlessly because warm air rises up from the water. And he is scanning, watching the water. The Osprey has incredible powers of sight. I mean, look at that eye. When I look at the water, all I can see is a glare coming off the water's surface. But Osprey Eyes have the ability to cut through the glare of the water's surface and spot fish silhouettes. When he sees a fish near the surface, he folds in his wings and dives! A diving Osprey can drop to the water at 120 kilometers per hour. He always comes in at an angle so that the fish can't see his shadow. Then he swings his talons forward and... Splash! Grab the fish! Huh, suddenly it's got extra weight and has to work those pectoral muscles and flap his wings hard to gain altitude. Got it, guys. This is great stuff. But I need more info on the Osprey's feet. What are they like? The talons are black, long, thin, and very, very pointy on the end. They are definitely used for gripping the fish. Hey, there's more. The toes. Each toe has hundreds of little hooks, and this must help to hold on to slippery fish skin. That makes sense. Ospreys have to have special gripping feet to grab slippery fish out of the water. I've got what I need. Because you've got a grip that just won't slip, I'm gonna name you Slip Grip. Yes, Slip Grip. Okay, we got a fish. Now where are we going? Oh! An osprey nest! I 
can quickly adjust the programming on another raptor suit to use for the Osprey. Add special eyesight for seeing objects clearly beneath the glare of the water's surface. Add special foot pads with dozens of microscopic hooks on each toe for holding onto slippery fish. Both key powers of the fish catching specialist, the Osprey. And we have Osprey power discs. I made them mini because that's what Chris and Martin are. Huh? Hi, Aviva. I heard you lost the key to your turtle ship. How about I help you find it? And then I'll take it and control your turtle ship and all its technology will be mine! <laughs> oh, hello, Zack. You're assuming that you'll find the key first, but the Wildcrats are already looking. Chris and Martin might be out looking, but they don't know that I'm here! Floating turtle to Osprey Sidekick. Come in, Osprey Sidekicks. <gasps> Cast communication blocking net! We have a new developer. <laughs> My advantage! <laughs> Whoa, this just keeps getting better. An Osprey chick. And I'll name you Fluffy Flyer. Hey, everybody, Slip Grip brought the fish back to the nest, and there's the cutest little raptor here. <laughs> Something's wrong. I'm getting nothing from the Tortuga. Uh-oh. We'd better get back there. Just need a quick power-up. All fueled. Great. Let's go. And there's the cutest little raptor here. Oh, so they found a baby birdie that they like. That's good to know. Just sit there and watch me find your Tortuga key. Zackbots, use your metal detectors and find me that key. I know you don't have any power to work your technology, so I'll just get myself something cool to drink. <laughs> Zack, that's why our comms aren't working. What's he up to this time? the communication blocking net. Hey, bros. What's going on? Shh. Zack has sent his Zack bots to find the Tortuga key. What? <sighs> and if he finds it first, we'll lose everything. We'll lose the Amphisub, Butterfly or XT, Buzz Bikes, Cheetah Racer, the Cratera. Here are the Osprey power discs. I press them as mini discs. Thanks, Thanks Aviva. Aviva. Oh, and the Falcon Flyer, the Guinea Fowl Flapper, Hippo Sub! Okay, don't worry, Jimmy. We'll activate Osprey powers and find the key before Zack does. I oh. know you won't! Swat those flies! Well, I'm a dragonfly, but Chris is a hummingbird. Ah! Catch us if you can! <laughs> uh. Whoa! Can activate our Osprey powers and find that key. Activate Osprey powers. Yeah. What? Uh oh. See anything? Oh, not through that crazy glare coming off the water. Oh, that's good for me. You thinking what I'm thinking, bro? Oh, yeah, I think so. Turn on Anti-Glare Osprey Vision. Buộc, buộc nó cái mặt mẹ này 
buộc mắt à, buộc tóc quá buộc tóc tóc nhện nó mắc me ngựa quá rồi gài cái lông mũi em mẹ thế này ngựa quá mẹ con cái nhỏ siêu à lúc này con mẹ con thấy hai con cái nhỏ siêu à chút xíu 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 à con hạt đi ba chân con mẹ con giống mẹ mẹ thương con vì con dung ba còn nhà ta cũng thương yêu nhau xanh là nhớ nhiều là cười rồi hả bác hả cho lên bà cho để bao cho cô thương cho thì cho không góc nhà không góc nhà để để chung cây cá ta vào nhà mấy ông mà quy tê cây để nó lên là 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 lên lên là Hạt rồi Chụp cái cái vui của ba luôn Chụp cái vui của ba luôn